what is up guys, it's your boy Siswe here, bringing you guys barbed wire tutorial. And on this barbed wire tutorial, it's basically just going to be teaching you guys how to like uh, create barbed wire effect. Basically, it's just making barbed wire inside Cinema 4D. And you can see it right here, it's kind of sort of looked the same, and uh, it's actually a pretty cool effect if you like uh, just add on effect on your Cinema 4D text or anything. So well, yeah, I'm going to do this right now and show you guys how to do this. So uh, we're just going to delete the one I have. And uh, you're going to have to need the plugin Reaper X for this to get this... Uh, right here like these kinds of perfect spline twirly twirls <laughs> but you're gonna need this effect you can simply type it on YouTube and you will find it with ease so what you wanna do is uh, you wanna drag in a circle Oop. Uh, we're gonna drag in a circle uh, you don't have to drag in a circle usually uh, reapers work with every AI meaning every uh, like clan logo you put in Cinema 4D to uh, put like stream nerves on or whatever so I'm gonna use a circle for this. You can use anything. Remember, you can use. I can even use the phase logo or AI right now as a circle replacement. So uh, just know that while we do this. So all right, what you wanna do now is you wanna go to Reaper uh, plugins, Reaper X plugin. You wanna drag that circle inside the Reaper. You wanna click on the Reaper, and then you wanna change your strands from three to two, and your radius also to two, and your distance to two, and it'll give it that tight, that tight like uh, little, like basically the tight strands you see in barbed wire right here so uh... right there you're done with that you can just simply change that off of view because all you need right now is the spline and end side so you're just going to spline click on end side and you just want to shrink this a bunch <clears throat> and uh... now what you want to do is when you click on your end side 